Government messengers here. Ask them in. Right. Please. 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 Good day. Please. Good day. Sit down, please. Thank you. Now, gentlemen, you want to see me? What's it about? I'll read this. Thank you. Prefect Wong. He's a good friend of mine. I'll certainly help if I can. Ah. Right. Lin Ying. Yes, teacher? Sao Wu. Yeah? Right. Coming. Teacher, what can I do? Read this. My dear friend, I've had bad news. Apparently, my home county, Long San, is suffering from a drought. I'm therefore sending a thousand tails of gold to the relief fund. However, as you know, there are many bandits in that area. And as I know you have some extremely good fighters in your circus, I should be grateful if you could spare a few of them to escort the gold to Long San. With best wishes, Prefect Wang. And here our story begins. In 1887, in the Qing Dynasty, the county of Lung San was hit by the worst drought ever experienced there. The crops withered in the fields, the livestock perished by the thousand, and the people began to die of starvation. But if the land was short of food, it had no shortage of bandits, and it was to protect a relief shipment of gold from these bandits that two noted circus performers were asked to escort the bullion to the famine-stricken county. As the people began to die in the streets, Local officials anxiously awaited news of the arrival of the much-needed relief goal. My lord, do you have any idea yet when this goal may arrive here? Um, all I heard was it left on the 6th. Well, I suppose it all depends on how it's being brought here. But it should arrive any day now. I just hope that it gets here soon. May I ask, sir, do you know how many escorts it has? Well, I understand there's only two of them. In that case, shouldn't we make an escort up to go and meet them? Right. Well, as Jay's is commander of the local militiamen, he should fix it. Yes, my lord. Unfortunately, my men aren't very good. And so, I don't think there'd be much use for this. Well, what do you suggest then? Uh, I think I'll ask Teacher Sue. At his school, there's some good men. Maybe he could lend some to us. Good. You ought to go and ask him.
Teacher, that was very impressive. <laughs> well now, your swordplay, I must say, is extremely impressive. Why, thank you. admit this. You two are the best I've had here. From what I've seen, the two of you would be a match for anybody that I can think of. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> You're much too kind. But still, we like to hear you say it. <laughs> hmm? Greetings, sir. Sit down. Well, it's very nice to see you, Captain. Now, how can I help? Well, sir, because of the drought that we've been suffering here, the government is sending a thousand tails of gold as a relief fund. However, we're worried about the bandits. And we need some men to act as an escort. Oh? Of course, of course. My best men, Chen Wei. And over here, Gong So. Oh, of course I've heard of them. Thank you. Oh. Well, now, thank you, sir. I'll tell the governor. Oh? I'll go right now. Hey, they're here. Listen, let's rest, eh? Good day, sir. Just stopping for a rest here? And where are you going to, eh? <laughs> We're going to Long... <laughs> it's quite a long way. A long way. <laughs> you going to Long Sang County? No, we're not. We're going to Mai Chi Do. Why do you ask that? Uh, nothing. Nothing. Just curious. Right. We're going. Hold it! That's ours! This one's yours. Let's go. Right.
Well, then, what went wrong? We're sorry. Those two. They're tough. Where did they go? Up north, to my chito. Where will they sleep? Uh, well, there's only one place there. That's the Yu Chow Inn. Hmm? Come in, come in. <laughs> Please. Uh, come in. <laughs> this way. <laughs> uh, you got any rooms? Oh, yes, of course. Uh, Chang? Take yeah. him upstairs. Right away. This way, please. <laughs> please. This way. <laughs> Mister, you come far? How long are you staying here? Just tonight. Oh, I see. Uh, and the lady here? Oh, I want a separate room. Oh, sure. All right, come with me. <laughs> Will this room be all right, miss? Of course. Good. Is there anything you need now? No, nothing right now. All right. Yes? Can I see you? Who is it? The manageress here. Good day. Nice to have you here. Well, thank you. Do come in. You on your way to Longshan? No. To Pa Sung To. Pa Sung To. Let me see. That's quite a way now. Well, now, if there's anything you should need, just let me know. I'd be very pleased to do it for you. You only have to say the word. Thanks. Tell me, what does your husband think? You going to guest rooms, I mean. Oh, he died last year and left me this place. I'm sorry. And you so young, too. Uh. Uh, that's a strong bag for carrying valuables, huh? Is that what it is? That's right. That's what it's for. Well, we could keep it for you in the safe. It's more secure. Hey. Mm -hmm. I'll keep it here, just so I know where it is. Well, what's in it? It's very valuable. Very. Be careful. Oh, sure. You like some tea? I'll get it. Oh, oh, oh I, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm terribly sorry. You tore my skirt off. I'm so sorry. Oh. I'm... How can I leave now? Listen, we'll go together, eh? I'll hide you. You watch that bag. I'll be back. Well then, 
What's he got? He said that it's gold. Oh. Huh. Well, let's relieve him of that, eh? And let's work out how to do it. I mean, I don't think you can do it. Hmm. I think I can. I mean, there's always one way. <laughs> well, give it a try. He likes me, I'm sure. He meant to tear my skirt, I know he did. You meant to? That fat old cow? Hmm. <laughs> really? <laughs> it's part of my strategy, don't you know? No, I don't. Strategy? For what, then? <laughs> well, if you don't know, you'll soon find out. Hmph. <laughs> I'll find out you're a lecher. Hey, Lin Ying. It was embarrassing. It was an accident. I was clumsy. Uh, oh. This will buy you a new dress. Oh, now look. I can't accept uh, it. Oh, I can't accept your please. money. I can't. Oh, please. No. I really do like you, you know. Uh, you. You're just trying to get round me, aren't you? Well, why shouldn't I? You can hardly blame me. Well... Who's that? Lin Ying. Hm. Uh, Lin Ying. Lin Ying. Lin Ying. What's wrong with you? Something I've done? You know what? Uh, yeah, sorry, sorry. So you should be. Look, I'll apologize. Dear Miss Lin, I'm very sorry. Uh, uh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. All right? Don't want apologies. They're no use to me. But while we're on this mission, 
You keep off the girls. All right, I will. And I've said I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Hmm? Oh, the bag. It's not there. The bag? Oh, it's been stolen. It's what? Been stolen? But that's the gold for those starving people. Is it? <laughs> Don't worry. I expected this. Those thieves will be very disappointed. Rocks! Damn it! Where's the gold? Speak up! I swear to you, I didn't open that bag. <laughs> Is that right, eh? <laughs> Tell me, where did the gold go? Sprouted wings and flew off? Speak up! I... Lousy bitch. Trying to get it all for yourself. No, I swear I didn't. Please don't kill me. I swear I didn't steal the gold. <laughs> That's what you say. All right, get out. You're too stupid to have taken it. Get out! Thank you very much. Thank you. Stay there. Well, why should we? Who are you? <laughs> it doesn't matter. But you're not going through to Long Shan. Not without my permission, and that's for certain. We've come a long way. So please, let us pass through. <laughs> sure I will. But, one condition. And what's that? Well, it's very simple. You can pass through, but the chair stays here. Otherwise, I'll have your head. If that's what you want, come and take it. Come on, then. Just try.
What style does he use? Well, I'm not sure. It's hard to say. What? You fought with him and you don't know? Listen, boss. It's just different. Like nothing I've ever seen. Really strange. Well, from what he says, it sounds like that fella from the circus. I remember I once saw him performing. <clears throat> and that girl as well. We'll get her as well. Let's get started with plan number two. Right. Hey. <laughs> if we can get hold of that gold, we're all going to be rich for life. <laughs> Let's go. Those men? They beat it. Let's go then. Hey, listen. This girl's had a bit of a shock. She's not feeling too good. So let her ride in the chair. Eh? What? Listen. Remember what I said. No women. Not until we're finished. I thought that we'd agreed that. Now look. I'm being nice. The girl needs help. All right? All right. Uh, thank you, miss. Mm -hmm. You do it. What do you say? You carry the chair. Uh -huh. If you're going to be so gallant, then follow through. Right. <laughs> All right. 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 Come on, then. Well, I must say, that's great. You and your daughter have done a damn good job. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Now that he's taken the bait, tell me, what next? <sighs> well, they both fight well. So if it's at all possible, we should try and split them up. Oh, I think I've got it. You can invite the guy for a meal. Say that you want to thank him. And while he's with you, I'll get the girl. That's a good idea. But what if he won't come? What then? Uh, 
Well, she does have a point there, <laughs> doesn't she? He'll come. Your daughter will take care of that. Who's inviting you? Uh, it's that girl. Listen, you shouldn't go. Why not? It's a trap. I'm sure of it. You may be right, but let's find out if it is. At least then I know what to expect there. I mean, I'll be on my guard. <laughs> you just want to see the girl. <laughs> I like to know who my enemies are. And I've had plenty of experience in this. I'll be all right. <laughs> now you go in and rest. Don't order me around. Go on then. Hey, listen. Lin Ying. Don't be mad. I'm not. Just go. Right. <laughs> Won't be long. Thank you. Uh, Mr. Wu, I'm most grateful. Without you, uh, she'd have been hurt. Uh, that's all right. In something like that, what else could a man do? I mean, it's his duty. If he didn't, then he's no man. I'm glad I was able to help. Very good. Regrettably, not many men are like you. One meets so very few. I mean, someone from the old school, with a good sense of honor. Ah, and to be such an able fighter as well. <laughs> Eat, eh? Huh? Please, you're flattering me. I'm just stating the truth and nothing more, eh? Huh? <laughs> now then. I want to thank you, too. I'm very grateful. So, here's to you. Uh, no. I've had enough. Come on. A man like yourself? He can drink more than that. <laughs> I mean, take my daughter. Even she drinks more than that. Hey, Sulan, you show him. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> right. Drink yours, too. Cheers. <laughs> <laughs>
All right, then, you. What do you want? I want your life. <laughs> Now then, tell me, where's the gold, eh? Speak up! I won't! You make it quick, or I'll kill you! I won't!
Lin Ying. Hmm. Hey, you all right? Yes, I am. I came back as fast as I could. Hmm. Ah, you... Hmm. You needn't have bothered. Go on. You can go on back to your girlfriend for all I care. Hey, now look. You were right. It was just a trap. I was nearly killed. Don't you care? Hmm. Well, it was your own damn fault. And I've had enough of you. You can go on by yourself. I'm leaving. Now, wait. Lin Ying, you can't do this. Let go! Hideous! You're useless. Good for nothing. I wish I'd been there. I'd have taken the swine to pieces I want. We've got to get that guy. Yes, I know that. But he's really a tough character. As a what? You always told me that you and your men could handle anything. All right, you. You can have a try now. Go to the ferry and you'll get in there. Right. get this card across, too. Right. I'll have to get some help. Hey! You fellas there! Come in here and give me a hand with this. I've got a heavy load here. I don't have any quarrel with you. It's a layoff. Yeah? You're wrong there. You killed some of our friends yesterday. And you're gonna pay for that. Yeah. 
Lin Ying. Lin Ying. If it wasn't for you, we'd have lost that gold. You pushed me in first, and I got to feeling lonely. And so I thought I'd have some company. <laughs> you rat! Am I? <laughs> what does that make you? And watch your tongue, or I'll spank you. <laughs> you try! I'll show you, you won't spank anyone! All right. <laughs> <laughs> it's lucky I can catch well. If I couldn't... You could have taken my head off with this rock. You come here! All right, you win. You win. Come on. When are you going to stop being as stubborn as you are? I can't stop. I'm born like this. You change, not me. So then, you got that? <laughs> <laughs> yes, all right. All right. I'm giving in. It's all my fault. You were quite right. It's my fault. Now then, check my clothes. See if they're dry. Hey, when we arrive at the next village, I'll buy you a meal. Now, come on. Let's not quarrel anymore. Hmm? Here! <laughs> now, look. 
things are getting pretty rough around here. Let's keep our eyes open. Come on. Korean Akado man, but I'm an admirer of Kung Fu, and I'd like to have a contest. Well, as I don't know you, no thanks. <laughs> That's all right. We haven't met yet, but let's skip the formalities. Ah, it's just a job I'm being paid for. Understand? <laughs> well, whenever you're ready, then. Listen, I'll take him. Hey, wait. This one's real tough. Well, we'll see. Huh? Hey! things first, huh? Get the gold. Now let's go.
can't die now. Don't get nervous. We were asked to come here just to meet you. This gentleman here is the head of our militia, Yang Ji. And this is one of the leading citizens, Su Yado. We were both assigned to meet you. Can you prove that? Uh... I had to make certain. We've had a lot of trouble. I am sorry. Oh, that's all right. Now then, you must be exhausted. Perhaps you'd both like to rest a while at my place. Listen, we finished our job. The gold's arrived and let them take it. And then we can visit teacher's brother here. Right. Captain, we've things to do. Perhaps you'd take over the gold. But still, when you've the time, I'll need a receipt. Of course, of course. Um. As a matter of fact, we're having a dinner for you tonight. And the gold? Hmm. We'll store it at my place. All right. We'll see you later then. Goodbye. 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 Take it. Mm -hmm. We may as well face it. It's no use. There's no business. So then we'd better move on. Right. Hello. Hello. Teacher. Ah. Ah. Teacher. Sao. Lin Ying. How nice. <laughs> Sit down. Cousin Wu, remember me, Sing Lee? Of course, but you've grown. <laughs> Please. Huh? huh? So Wu, have you been hurt? We've been in several fights. It's my back. It got hurt. Better go to my place. Then I can take a look at it for you. Thanks. Thanks a lot. Listen, you come with me and change your clothes. Right. Right. Please.
Oh dear. You've got a bad injury there. It's quite serious. What do we do? Uh, it's all right. I can use acupuncture on it. You'll see. And once I've given you a couple of treatments here, you'll be all right. Oh, good. Sawu, your clothes. Thanks. Uncle, can I have a word with you? Hmm. Well, now, what is it? Listen, he's got a bad wound, and he really ought to rest. So then, I'll go to town, find Mr. Sue, and get that receipt for the gold. So then, you take care of him. Hmm, sure. But get back soon. Oh, sure I will. See you. Hmm. Hey, listen. You come with me. Sure. Eh? Bye. Bye-bye. Bye. 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 See Bye. You. I must say, we're extremely grateful for your help. Now I better take the gold to the mayor's place. Then he can share it out. Those poor folk really need it now. So then, I'll be on my way now. Goodbye. Thanks once again. All right. Pick up the gold. Sir. Right. right. Hold it. Captain Yang. I work very hard to get that gold here. And if you're thinking of taking it, you're on. It's staying right here. Listen, are you mad? We need that gold for all the refugees. And if you try to hold it up, the law will deal with you. <laughs> the law? Well, I'm the law. Even split into three, this will make us very rich men. Mm. You're right. But look, we'll have to leave here. Mm -hmm. I think we should head for Manchow. Right. Let's get going. Hold it! You rat! And I thought you were an honest man. What a laugh! You must be the biggest rogue of them all, you lousy thief! And what's happened to that captain? Did you kill him? <laughs> well, that's something you're never going to find out. But now that you know the truth, what'll you do? I tell you this. You try and take that gold out, and I'll kill you. <laughs> well, you can hardly expect me to take that threat very seriously.
You'll soon be all right. I'm very grateful to you. No, it's nothing. It's the least I can do. Oh, listen, where is Lin Ying? Uh, she went downtown for the receipt. Oh, I wondered where she'd got to. Teacher! Oh, teacher! Oh, oh, oh. Asan, what's wrong with you? He's been badly hurt. Yes, and so have you. Lie down here, I'll fix this. And don't you worry now. Oh, what's happened? Shh. Oh, Sam, what happened? Mr. Su, he grabbed that gold. He wounded me. Lin Ying's still fighting there. I know. Somebody's got to help her. And you can die, too. Listen, I'll get the gold. You take him. Hmm. How silly. You can't wait to die. It's you who'll die. What? All right. Let's fight this out up on the hill, then. If you've the guts. On the hill?
You take the gold. I'll stay. Right. Uh-huh. 